The fair is not just full of things to see and do, it's full of things to buy. Sure, that includes the normal types of souvenirs. Hats, 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 and body jewelry. That's the PG version of Shot Shot Shots from Little John. Yeah. But it also includes a shockingly large variety of non-impulse buys, like home renovations and stuff. The great thing about the fair is that it's the only place that's both a theme park and Home Depot at the same time. <laughs> Jeez, I thought I did a bad parking job. I do not want to hear about what kind of rubbing you're doing in your man cave. <laughs> Much of the commerce at the fair was lumped together in the creatively named Expo Hall 4. And it's <laughs> Except with an average age of like 40 years older. Well, they might not have thought of a name, but they sure thought of interesting decor. So we got a bunch of donuts and just one pair of lips. Ah. The hall was full of many vendors, but it was sponsored by Mattress Firm. Mattress Firm, sleep now, pay later. <laughs> that just sounds like a threat. Yep. And Mattress Firm had an area for their subdivision with a less specific name, Furniture Firm, where we tried some sample time in massage chairs. The camera wasn't rolling while we were in the massage chairs, but they were intense. Like, so intense that they probably contributed to our decision to not ride anything at the fair. The massage chair broke again. Oh no! The rest of the vendors in the expo hall range from very small businesses to giant corporate interests. But the vast majority of items for sale had one very crucial thing in common. They were absolutely not practical. But some of them were very pretty. Ooh, I want these in the backyard. Yes. I want fake rocks. Yeah. Some of this is just the farmer's market, and some of this is just the home shopping network. Some of this is just like a mall where they forgot to build rooms. Like, the, like all mall kiosks all the time. Yeah. Hey gang, let's have fun at the life insurance booth. Tupperware, you're like a famous brand. <laughs> what are you doing here? Yeah. All right, honey. Look, I know you've been wanting a purse that's also jeans, that's also a shoe. Oh, so. <laughs> and as you all know, my turquoise bed is just well known throughout the land. So. <laughs> and here's the wine mom booth. Yes. Do you think they licensed Batman for that ad? Even the DMV has a booth. Oh, I kind of dig these. The uh, paintings with the light effects in them. Cool, yeah. You can also get that effect at home with your own ingenuity. It's true, it's true. I didn't say I was going to spend money on it, I just said it's pretty. <laughs> oh, gang, I've been waiting for this all day. The Forest Lawn Cemetery booth. Yeah. Right, then, here we go. I know we talked about that I might want to be cremated, but if you put me in a Dodger's urn... <laughs> you might divorce me from beyond the grave. <laughs> it, it's possible. You might be haunted. Oh, do we have to try and compare each and every massage chair in this building? Not that you're saying it, I think we have to now. Look back, neck and shoulder, square and feet, square and feet. I will be very surprised if there's not a safe that size in one shot of Knives Out. <laughs> Wait, gang. Gang, we, we slipped up by doing regular massage chairs instead of cyber relax. What is this? It's, it's the thing! It's, it's the, the thing. thing! Practically the thing! Yes. Please, I, I'm sorry. For science. How's that broken treadmill treating you? Interesting feeling. Oh, my oh yeah. Woo. This is just to prepare you for feeling earthquakes living out here. Yeah. yeah. I'm basically doing my best Mickey impression right now. This thing is like. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Wow. This is wild. my treadmill, it broke somehow, and uh, now it just does this. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm just
just waiting for like the band that goes around. Nineties techno, yay! Dave, I'm gonna get the picture of that sign that's like right by you. Yeah. The the back pain. Do you want to try this out here? I am good, thank you. I think this is actually a mistake right after the massage chair because whatever was digging into my side here is now really being, uh, really being aggravated. <laughs> it's, it's like a smoothie maker yeah. and exercise machine at the same time. I have a Ninja Blender final game. <laughs> <laughs> now try the hula hoop. <laughs> Now try to jump rope. Nope. Oh lord, no! It sprained an ankle. I would like to speak to the manager. I'm literally shaking with anger. <laughs> wow. That's enough of that, That's, I think. Yeah. <laughs> and that was just some of the strange collection of things available for sale we saw at the fair. While we didn't succumb to any of these purchases, there is something we couldn't go the day without spending money on, and that's food. So join us next time for that most crucial fair experience, eating fried things. A fair is a veritable smorgasbord, orcasbord, orcasbord after the gates are shut. Each night when the lights go out, it can be found on the ground all around.